So, what is it that you can tell us about the group that you come from? Are they good people? No. These are not good people. Our leader, she's a dictator over the rest of us. What do you mean by that? She's had this practice for a while now where she takes over other groups and converts them into soldiers to fight for her cause by any means necessary, including torture. The group that I was a part of, we went through a similar process. Jesus Christ. Well, thanks for telling us all of this, Ellie. You've been a great help. Please, please don't make me go back there. No, no, no. We're not going to send you back. You can stay here if you'd like. The rest of us are going to talk about what to do next and hopefully get the rest of your people out of there. Okay. Thank you, Dom. All right. Where do we go from here? I don't know. We don't even know how many people are a part of this group that Ellie came from. Either way, these people could be dangerous and try to brainwash the people of our communities. That is true. Maybe we can get more information out of her. It would help in protecting not only her, but our own people. Just make sure you don't make her feel uncomfortable. Otherwise, she might not help us. I'll see what I can do. Well, this is it. According to Ellis, we should reach Willow Station by tomorrow afternoon. I'm really hoping that there will be a train there. Otherwise, this whole trip will have been for nothing. Don't worry, Jake. There will be a train. There's got to be at least one of the dozens of trains still there. If I may butt in, since we should be reaching our goal by tomorrow, I think this calls for a little celebration. You've got to be kidding me, right? What? All the shit that we've been going through after almost a year of surviving this damned apocalypse? We deserve this. I've got to agree. Pass me that bottle, man. You want a swig, Emma? Yeah, I'm going to give that a hard pass. Enjoy getting wasted. <laughs> Suit yourself, then. How about you, Jake? I'll have just a little. I don't drink that often, because I'm not a big fan of booze. Why's that? My mom, she was an alcoholic. A bad one at that. She ended up having to go to rehab and all that crap. Ever since then, I've tried to avoid it as best as I can. Sorry to hear about that, Jake. Eh. I do still sometimes need some swigs to calm my nerves on some occasions. Smart of you to turn down that drink. I've had a little before, believe me. I snuck a bottle from my parents' liquor cabinet a long time ago. And needless to say, it tasted terrible. Wow. Never knew you had it in you to sneak booze, Emma. <sighs> just look at the stars. The sky just looks so beautiful tonight. Not as beautiful as you, though. Oh, shut up. Your pickup lines are so damn cheesy. They're not meant to be pickups. They're meant to make you laugh, and... Clearly it's working. Oh man, what would I do without you? Looks like everyone inside is finally asleep now. Damn. Takes forever for Jamie to fall asleep. My uncle told me that she never went to sleep early even on school nights. <laughs> Guess that's another thing that we have in common. I hate sleeping. It's such a waste of time. I mean, think of all the things that you could be doing instead. 
Instead, you're just lying there, passed out, not doing anything. I'll be right back. I gotta take a piss. And put another log on the fire before it dies out. Yeah, yeah, sure thing. Don't move. I've got some questions to ask you. You can ask me questions without putting a gun to my head. Just put it down and we can talk. I'm not in the mood right now, mister. Just answer the questions and I'll be on my way. Alright. Knock yourself out then. I'm looking for a girl. Young little ginger with a red jacket. I haven't seen anyone like that. Sorry. I can help you find her if you'd like. I don't think you understand how severe this is, sir. You've got a lot of other people looking for her. She's a very dangerous person who could be spreading lies about our people. Why should I believe you? Because I- <clears throat> You okay, man? Oh, God, Ken. What have you done? What are you talking about? I just saved your life. This guy has tons of others looking for a girl. They're gonna find us now and kill all of us for this. Wh what? Are you, are you being serious with me? I'm being as serious as it can get. We gotta get the hell out of here. <laughs> So, should we split up from here? Yeah. Take James over by that shoe store. I'm gonna go over to that seafood restaurant to see if I can find anything useful. Are you sure about this, Grace? The last time you left home, you lost an eye. I was with two shitbirds that caused damage to all of us for being so damn stupid. I'd say that I have better odds this time around. If you say so. Alright, this is perfect. We can use these bricks and boxes. It's not a lot, but it'll help. Here, James, help me load these onto the cart. Oh, jeez, these are heavy. Probably heavier than me. I wouldn't go that far, but yeah, they are heavy. Hopefully we can find other boxes of bricks. Then after that, that should be more than enough to finish up the clock tower. We're gonna need a lot more people here to help us to get these back to the hospital, though. All that matters is that we get it done. That way we won't all be packed like sardines when we sleep at night. This is the outpost that Ellie told us to go to. Keep your eyes open for others. She said that there will most likely be other people here. It's fine, Dom. Look, there's a guy over there. I'll go distract him. You sneak over by that brush and if anything gets out of hand, you sneak up on him and knock him out or shoot him or something, I don't know. Alright. I'll hide over in that brush and let you do most of the work. Stay standing. Don't yell. Don't try anything. And I don't shoot you. Who are you? Well, I'm Randy, mister. And who are you? Anthony. And I'm here to kill you. Now, that's not very polite. Why would you want to go and do that now? Don't play dumb with me. I know all about what your group does to other people and how your leader forces other groups to fight for her. How'd you learn about all of that? It's a pretty big claim to make towards me. Doesn't matter. I'm here to go through with this regardless of what happens. 
I had that, man. I know. But you were kind of taking forever. Anyways, don't waste your bullets on him. We have some walkers coming this way. Just leave him to get eaten. Find whatever is good in this place and let's get out of here. <laughs> What I tell you folks, we got here in record time. This is it, Bry. We finally made our way to this station for us to venture further in this new world. This is great. It's perfect. Now, let's see what this place has to offer. <laughs> 